What if we succeed by letting kids fail? One of the first things a student new to Parker has to come to understand and appreciate is that we see failure and making mistakes as a key part of learning. Their experience here is going to be more like learning to ride a bike than it is a traditional classroom or traditional educational setting. They're going to fall down, they're going to get back up, they're going to get some coaching and help, but over time they are truly going to master this skill and be able to exercise it their whole life. Parker has been a unique experience where they've given me the opportunity to discover who I am as a learner. This has been instrumental in continuing my growth and my learning across really any subject. Math can make sense, I just have to give myself the opportunity to be wrong first, and then I can really improve and, and grow in my strength in math. And now I want to be an engineer, and, and math is coming with me to college, and it's going to be something I love and enjoy for the rest of my life. When I was in elementary school and middle school, I loved getting that perfect report card. I loved getting all the A's. I was like, oh gosh, I have to do everything in my power to be at the top of my class, and that was my main focus, and I sought validation in that. When I got to Parker, everything changed. We didn't have grades anymore. It changes your perception about what the goal is. The goal is not to get an A or focus on that A, it's about okay, let's focus on developing these skills, and then what's the journey in doing so? We're doing something wrong if the kids get it right, right away. We often do our most robust and long-term learning by doing something not quite right the first time and having to understand ourselves what to do or how to do it differently. Those are durable understandings, ones that'll last for years. If you've been a Parker student, you're never going to lose that confidence that I may not remember exactly how to do this formula, but I know how to find out and I know how to tackle this. One of the central metaphors in the school is the idea of learning being like climbing a mountain. And the central belief of the school is that every kid can get to the top of that mountain, that success is not a limited commodity, that not only the best climbers get to the top, everybody gets to the top. But students need very different things in order to get there. For some of the kids, the trail map is irrelevant. And so our job is to meet them in the parking lot and see where they are and figure out what's preventing them from starting the climb and really hold for them the goal that they can get to the top until they believe it themselves and build the skill set that allow them to get there. <laughs>